what's up guys so I'm gonna be starting off with my eyebrows as usual you guys I need to stop with this hand gesture stuff like do you guys use your hands to talk but um, I always use my hands I'm not sure why when did I when did I pick that up or what made me pick that up but I use my hand so much and I've never noticed that until I started um, I started filming then I noticed that I do it all the time do you guys use your hand like even like just right now and I tried not to I'm as I'm talking about it and I still did it but how have you guys been it's been a while since your girl did a sit down talk through this is not about the makeup it's just more about um, just sitting down and talking to you guys again I just wanted to chit chat about life um, life has been really great for me so far so what's been going on with y'all one thing that's been going on with me is I am I am just getting reconnected with God. Jayla Corian did a video about manifestation and this book that she used is called Wake Up Girl and Push Through. I will leave it in the description box below. So pretty much it's like a three to five minute of prayer every morning that you say before you get your day started. And that book really has been helpful. I think it's a good start just to if you're trying to get reconnected with God and just don't know where to start or, you know, it's just a small thing that it's a small change that will lead to a bigger change. So I think that book is really um, a good start for anybody that's interested in that. That's one positive thing and it really has me on a good uh, spirit and it has helped me just. I don't know it's just helped me look at life in a good light and just take it easy on myself you know life is life is hard and you cannot make it harder on yourself so just whatever it is that you need for your sanity you go for it girl and that book is what is working for me right now so I went ahead and did my eyebrows off camera so now we're gonna get into the eyes. I've been trying to perfect my makeup skills and I've been watching a lot of like professional makeup videos. And I was watching makeup by Ariel, Ariel or Ariel, but his beats are always so natural, so glam, like na natural glam. And that's what I'm really into nowadays. So I've been doing, um, like skin tone concealer on top of my eyes and then uh, a lighter concealer on the bottom and then um, he does he goes in with a powder and he um, kind of mute out all that color and this is a wet sponge by the way now I'm looking crazy I'm like looking real crazy I'm gonna use this brush and um, put some powder on my eye Oh my gosh, I look <laughs> What is this? He puts powder on the eyelids before he continues on. So he starts off with, he uses the same contour uh, color that he uses on the cheeks. He goes and um, uses that on the out, upper part of the eye we're just gonna put that on the out like the upper part of the eye and this is becoming a makeup tutorial now but it's not a makeup tutorial it's a chit chat video but this is um we're just catching up and this is part of what i've been doing lately is trying to perfect my makeup and my makeup and doing my like neutral look so this look is the look I'm going for is like glam and neutral for the holidays. 
your outfit is gonna do the talking and then your eyes kind of has to complement the outfit for Christmas you're already gonna do color and you don't want to also do color in your eyes I mean you can go for it if that's what you want to do girl but I like like a neutral neutral kind of look and I'm just focusing that on like the upper part of my eye he's a darker brown and he focuses that in the like crease part but not too much more on the outer part of the eye so that's what we're gonna do taking that and I am putting it on the outer part of my eye focusing it more on the outer parts and leaving the center of my eye alone because we gonna cut that crease girl we gonna cut that crease what shows are you guys into comment down below in the past I was the girl that watches TV and then as I grew older I just do not watch TV anymore um, but right now I am watching ready to love it's such a old people show if you want to say but it's interesting to me because I like the relationships like to see how relationship works but if you don't know what um, ready to love is it's like a show about it's black people and they're um, I think it's like 10 single men and 10 single women and then they kind of just date and try to figure out who they're compatible with and um, it's interesting to see how we interact and in, like the dating scene now because I've been out the dating scene <clears throat> for a minute 2014 is when my fiance and I got together and things are way different now. Free to Love is one of the shows I am really liking right now. And then um, Queens. Queens is good. They they be doing too much drama. What? They be doing too much though. So um, I, right now I'm using... It's one of my new pickups. And it's the Morphe's P. Louise base. I picked this up to cut my crease. And to help my color pop out a little bit, this is what Makeup by Ariel does. I'm sorry if I'm saying that wrong, but correct me in the comment section. But that's what Makeup by Ariel does. So you just kind of create your own crease. Looking down kind of helps to create to see where you want to create your crease. So I'm going to go ahead and start in the middle and then work my way down. Our crease is now cut. I had to... Cut the cameras. <laughs> this ain't easy. It is not easy cutting the crease. But so he cut the crease like this, and then um, uh, yeah, you just take a lighter shade that you like. Uh, for the holidays, I think I want to do something like neutral that's closer to this shade right here. Dating nowadays. How do you guys feel about it? You guys feel like it's different than back then and or do you feel like it's the same? I don't know. Leave it in the comment section. You guys tell me what you guys' um, traditions for Christmas are. For me, um, ever since we were little, uh, one of our traditions, I think it's a Sudanese thing. If you guys don't know, I am South Sudanese. But one of our traditions is um, you get brand new clothes and um, it's special Christmas clothes, you know. On Christmas you gotta step, gotta step. And guess where we're going? Church. Yes. So on Christmas we go to church and um, it's usually Christmas morning and sometimes Christmas Eve we'll go to church but we usually my family does it Christmas morning and um, on Christmas in Sudan we actually do what everybody does here for Halloween on Christmas so you'll go around and visit family members and they have like cookies like it's special cookies that are usually made for Christmas it's Habis, Bitfort and 
This is gonna sound weird, but it's called cock. <laughs> oh gosh, yeah. But um, and then they give out candies. So that's what it used to be like when I was a kid growing up, and it was so much fun. I kind of miss that. Makeup by Ariel usually finishes the whole eye first and then move on to the face, but mm -mm, I can't do that. We're going to move on to the face and I'm using my primer, the milk, milk primer. I take about like maybe two pumps. I use it all over my face and I also picked up the Fendi, Fenty sponge by Bad Guy Riri. I saw um I saw online the other day they were saying she was pregnant. I don't think so. I don't think she is, but if she is, congratulations girl. Baga Riri um is a millionaire now and she's been wanting a kid, so why not? We're gonna go in with our concealer and I'm using the LA Girl Pro. I'm using LA Girl Pro Concealer and this is in the shade Fawn. I'm really into like the super highlighted under eye now. So I went up like five shades from my skin tone. And I'm loving it. My chocolate drip by, I don't know who it's by anymore. Complexion, I think. But this is all I have left of it. So if you guys have a better um, contour stick for a darker skin or just contour product, let your girl know. People like to let it dry, but I just go ahead and go on with it. And um, I move upwards with the contour. So what should you guys expect from me on this channel moving forward? Lots of vlogs, lots of um, maybe some chit chat, sit down chit chat videos, some fashion, I uh, have a Shein tutorial, I mean Shein tutorial, Shein try on haul coming and I also have a like a sit down chit chat. I'm excited for my channel. Where it's gonna go from here. We getting. We getting there girl. Um, Shout out to YouTubers. Because. I'm not even. No big time. Nobody right now. And your girl already like. Like. Like, this is hard. Oh, shout out to you guys for that. And one thing I noticed as of lately that um, people are shying away from YouTube. Do you guys feel that way? Like, I feel like the people that used to post often, they don't post like that. Like, some of my favorites have gone to their pages and, like, their last post, like, three months ago, six months ago. And I'm just like, what's going on? Talking about YouTube, let me know what you guys like, what you guys want me want me to share with y'all. Um, like I said, the stuff that I mentioned, I'm going to make videos on those. But if there's anything else that you guys are interested in or you want me to talk about, just leave it in the comment section and let me know. My camera said I'm doing too much talking, so we're just going to go ahead and get the rest of this video going um we're gonna go in with our powder it's fenty pardon my mess <laughs> what's going on here i'm gonna go in with my um uh, not contour but not contour, but my uh, bronzer. Oops, my bronzer. Fint is the Fenty 
same sun stalker I've been using so I just bronze go ahead and bronze my face Doing a talk through is hard. Like I've been doing makeup now for I don't know, maybe like two hours and I ran out of stuff to say. It was crazy. I'll go ahead and finish my eyes. I'm just gonna line it. I can outline it on camera. Still working on that. And then um add my lashes. BRB. Well, I went ahead and did my eyeliner and put my lashes on. The lashes I use are um, these right here from the beauty supply store. The INV lashes and it's the number KPE 118. So um, I used brown instead of black liner today. I used um, my my Anastasia um, brow pen that I used earlier on my brows because I didn't find my black one but this one turned out great anyways so we love that I was gonna do cheeks but I'm liking just the neutral look so it's a ho the holiday so we can't go without our bronzer or highlighter and I'm gonna use the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, glow kit I kind of strayed away from doing highlighters for a little bit, but some looks you just gotta have, you just have to add it. Like, it is too cute not to add it. I'm gonna go ahead and spray my face with the um, All Nighter Spray. For my lips, I have like these two items, and this has been my combination ever since I got them, and it is the um Nima Tang and Dose of Colors collab. Nima Tang did that. She came through for our us dark skin sisters because this is everything. I haven't put it down since I got it. So I used the lip liner and I, I forgot what this is called. Okay, chocolate chip lip liner. And I go ahead and lip line my outer lips with that. I take the lipstick and this is in Penny and I put that in the inner of my lips and there you go here is uh, the final look but let me go ahead and throw something on real quick and I'll be right back all right that is the completed look I really hope that you guys enjoyed this sit down talk through with me well I keep saying talk through, but it's really uh, just like a sit down chit chat video with this New Year's look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, I will leave the links that I can find of the products I use down in the description box down below. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and watching yet another video. Don't forget to share, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!